Well, helping raise money to fund agricultural youth activities is the goal of a group of women known as the Diamond Hats. Joining me now to tell us about a fundraiser that sounds like a lot of fun are Lacey Del Culley and Monica Wilkie. Well, Monica, tell me a little bit about the Diamond Hats and the fundraiser. Sure. The Diamond Hats is an organization that was founded in 2005, and our vision goal is to elevate youth in agriculture. And we start our year in March um, in association with the Oklahoma Youth Expo. We gave away over $16,000 in scholarships last year to students. We do some other fundraisers throughout the year and end our year with the event we're here to talk about today, and that's our Diamond Hat Ball on November the 7th. That's our largest fundraiser, and um, we hope to continue to grow the organization and continue to give more money to these outstanding youth. And, and you fund these scholarships through the live auction and a silent auction? Yes, we've had a lot of generous donors this year. We have a wide variety of items, some agriculture related like uh, Bob Funk's generous donations of trips to fly fish in Alaska or spend a weekend at his UU Bar Ranch in Cimarron, New Mexico, uh, to also NCIS memorabilia autographed by Mark Harmon. There's diamonds donated by Brockhouse Jewelers of Edmond, hence the word diamond hats. We're all about jewelry. <laughs> <laughs> Certainly, it sounds like it. Tell us a little bit more about when the fundraiser will be and how people can get, in, get involved. Sure, it's on November the 7th. It will be at the National Cowboy Western and Heritage Museum in Oklahoma City. You can find more information about the event itself on diamondhats.org. Um, tickets are $150 a piece and we look forward to seeing everyone there. It's a fun night. We have a lot of interesting entertainment. Um, we have a youth group gonna perform. Lacey knows a little bit about them. Jennifer Reynolds will be emceeing, and we're gonna give away some awards as well. Yeah, and all the money yeah. certainly does go to a great organization. And, and tell me a little bit about who will be playing at the... the Oklahoma Stomp is a young man's group. They all fiddle, and it's kind of a Bob Wills, uh, junior version of Bob Wills and the Texas Playboys along with that entertainment, we'll be honored to have the Lieutenant Governor Jerry Askins um, as our honorary chairperson for the event. Well, it, it certainly sounds like a, a fantastic event, and uh, if you want to know more about it, you can go to our website as well. And well, I continue my conversation with both Lacey and Monica on our website at okhorizon.com.